Again, we just had a new content drop. Uh, let me get this thumbnail changed out. We will get into it. But yeah, anybody that shows up, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe and hit that like button if you're enjoying this. And follow me on Twitter, Benningfield01. I always tweet whenever I go live or a new video drops. Uh, we got uh, Lovely Lime hanging out with us. A couple other people just hopped up in here, but he's the only one that's in the chat with me. Yeah. Yep, there's the man. Uh, let me get the find this thumbnail but we do have uh, a couple new bonuses and stuff and I'm gonna check out some other stuff see what's going on see if what I've seen so far is it the sea breeze did come out today as was leaked we're gonna buy it customize it up so let me find this thumbnail I don't think anybody's up in here yet but maybe some people will be viewing for too long let me get it tweeted out and all that fun stuff too. Come on, where's my thumbnail at? We're getting closer. Where is it? There it is. We'll go. With, we'll go with that. What's up? All right, that's in there. Save the changes. Sorry, everybody. I'm slow. Anybody that's popping in or watching this later, of course. I don't think anybody's in here right now, but... Alright, let me bring up my chat. We'll go ahead and look at it, though, while I'm getting ready to tweet it out. It's under the Elitist Travel. It's actually got a picture of it on the, the little box for Elitist. There it is. Uh, I have the discount price. I'll have to look it up to see what the buy it now price is, but it's 850000 if you've done the missions to unlock the discount price. Yeah, skip ahead. Let me get it tweeted out. But we'll go ahead and get that purchased so I, we can wait for that to deliver. 850000 Yes, we're going to buy it now. First, we'll read over it. As the pilot of a western sea breeze, you'll have to get used to a lot of attention. Onlookers will marvel at the amphibious aircraft that looks so sleek and business-like. They will gaze in longing at the chic and temporary interior. They will gasp and cheer as you try to bail out and a unique tail-mounted propeller turns you into soup. Become, <laughs> wow, welcome to your 15 minutes of fame. Please note this aircraft is excluded from Pegasus Lifestyles Management and must be stored in a personal hangar. There you go. We are live, tweeted out to the Twitterverse. I don't think anybody's awake around here. But yeah, we'll get it purchased. Buy it now, 850000 Not a horrible price. We'll see what all kind of customization it does have, though. Whenever it does arrive. And then we'll check out the other bonuses and stuff. We'll hop it up. Actually, I'll go and check it now. Um, back out of there, though. But you go into online jobs, play jobs, go down to Rockstar Created, and these adversary modes, the beat, Beast versus Slasher, it's pretty much all of the old Halloween ones. They put double money and RP on them now. So all the Beast versus Slashers. And that includes the ones for the bunker, the Slasher for the bunker, and I think that may be the only bunker one. But yeah, Slasher. Beast versus Slasher. Come out to play is double money. The Condemned is still double money and RP. Uh, let's roll down. I wish Deadline was there. Deadline. Uh, Entourage, no. I know there's more. I know the regular slasher is too. The, uh, keep the pace. Kill quote is not. Land grab. Lost versus Damn. This is one. I always call this Angels versus Demons. But this is probably my favorite PvP one. It is, came out last Halloween. It is double money, double RP now. And we got the, uh, what's up, Tyler Noel? First one up in there. Checking it out. Uh, what's up, Nuno? Good morning. Or late morning. Whatever you want to call it. And the regular slashers, they're double money. There's only five of those. Uh, is there anything else? Oh, they put the stockpile up. Stockpile's back double money in RP. That didn't even have anything to do with Halloween. That's double money, double RP. And that may be it. Yeah, that's it. What's up, D. Bailey in the house? 
we'll check out uh, in the stunt races I do want to show the transform races they're no longer double money in RP except for the new one the Inferno still is the rest of them are not they took they got rid of that you give me respect for doing this I stayed up for this I didn't I got uh, <laughs> I got lovely Lime in the chat with me. He was there. I was literally giving it one last chance switching lobbies and I found it. I uh, think the discounts are all the same. I'm going to check this other stuff. Uh, death matches. I don't think any of that will be. Uh, we can check missions though. Maybe they threw in some double money missions. What's up, J82? Finally getting a couple of people showing up in here. But yeah, Sea Breeze is out. They changed up the bonuses. They did. Uh, Pretty much all the old Halloween adversary modes are double money in RP. And then they threw in stockpile for some reason. Versus aren't. Survival. I don't think survivals would be. No. Yeah, it's just the adversary mode so far is all I found. We'll go over them again. Beast versus Slasher. In the bunker, you have the Slasher for it. It's double money. The come out to play, that's double money. Condemned is still double money in RP. Uh, where's the next one? In and out, no. You got a ways to go for the next one. There it is, Lost vs. Damn. This is probably my second favorite adversary mode of all. I love Deadline, this is probably my, a close second for me. So we'll definitely be playing some of this on the channel. Um, your Xbox won't connect to servers. You can't play GTA right now. Yeah, I had some like weird issues. I thought it was my PlayStation messing up with my router reset on me earlier, like about an hour ago. Uh, the slashers, they're all double money. Double RP. Stockpile, I don't know, this one really doesn't have anything to do with Halloween, but they put it back as double money, double RP. And as far as I know, we did all of our selling of our hanger crates. I don't know if they're still double money in RP. But whatever. But there's the Sea Breeze. I did purchase it for those of you that weren't in here. I don't know offhand what the buy it now price is because I already had the missions done. But if you have the missions done, it's 850000 We purchased it and we're going to go over what customization it has. Hopefully got some nice weapon upgrades or something for it. It is a two-seater. So that's something a little different. And it lands on water and that's something a little different. Alright, we'll get into the customization. Armor, upgrades, 50000 I don't know why. Countermeasures. I always do the flares. So we'll go with the flares again on that. The difference is the smokes are just cosmetic pretty much. I mean, I guess they technically kind of distract somebody if they're all right on your tail. And the chap or shaft or whatever you want to call that is if they, it breaks a lock that they have on you. And the flares, if they've already fired the rockets, the rockets will chase the flares. So I feel like the flares is the best. So we'll go with that. Engine, we'll upgrade that all the way. Handling, I always upgrade all the way. Uh, livery, I don't know what they have on these. I haven't even really paid attention to this plane before, so. Shooting star, not bad. Adds a little blue star to it. Yeah, until November 6th, I thought so. Yeah. We're going to go and check out the crates and some other stuff to see if they've added any bonuses to stuff like that. The only thing we won't be able to tell is, I don't have my biker stuff filled up, so I wouldn't be able to tell that. And uh, the hangar stuff, so if they like speed it up. I couldn't tell that, but I can tell if they doubled the money on it because I should have some in there. What's up, Tyler Robido? It's here in the house. Okay, Shooting Star. It's got the blue and yellow stars. Not too bad. Shooting Star Yellow. It just kind of reverses it a little bit. So it's a slightly different color blue in the middle. Sun Streaker. That's not too bad. It's like, I don't know. It feels like an old style car to me on that one. I like that blue, though. Sun Seeker Blue looks good. That one looks pretty good. I like that. The Wave Rider Blue, Wave Rider Red, Seaways Blue, Seaways Orange. I love orange. I might have to go with some orange. That's even though it's a really light orange. I like the Seaways. What is that got? Oh, that's got the darker orange and mixed in with the blue. I kind of like that too. And that one's got the orange. That one's got the most orange. Wave out. Well, actually, it's technically red, but it looks orange to me. Um, I don't know. I kind of like that. Let's go with the Wave Rider Blue for now. A uh, respray primary. The crew color. Whoa, that crew looks good on it. Look at that. <laughs> I 
I kind of like that. Metallic. Let's see what the secondary changes before I do anything else. Okay, so I thought it's just like the little top part. Nice. Uh, if we could find like a bright blue, that would be good if they had like a crew blue. Alright, we'll go uh, secondary. Metallic. Maybe a yellow on there, and a bright the yellow that matches the livery. I, don't know. I usually like take hours on vehicles, so sorry if I'm taking a little too long. I already had the closest yellow on it. I might just do like a ice white on that, and then change the primary color to. I don't really like the ice white on it now. I'll probably just do them both the same color, actually. Probably go with an orange, most likely. It's kind of like a weird look it has. But it's an orange. Passed right over it. Sorry, guys. I'm like all into my colors. I like that crew orange. We're going with that bright crew orange on both. Secondary. That is a bright vehicle right there. We love it. All right, now here's the most important part, the weapons. I wanted to see what kind of weapons upgrade this has. Bombs and primary weapons. Oh, I like that it has primary weapon options. Uh, explosives and clusters are probably your best two. And I don't think the clusters are really worth the difference. I think explosives is probably the best way to go. So we're going to go with the explosives on the bombs. Primary weapons. Oh, you just, it upgrades to, oh, it has no weapons or machine guns. That's kind of gross. I was hoping for some kind of bombs or something but we'll go ahead and add the machine guns all right so that's what we got on weapons i was really hoping some like explosive rounds or some homing rockets but it doesn't have it all right so that is it for customizing this thing we'll uh we'll exit the hangar in it we'll fly it around a little bit we got us a nice bright new plane i think there's some people come showing up in the lobby so hopefully we don't get it all shot up oh that was that was lovely lime it scared me yeah, just doing donuts. Yeah. thing's got some sharp handling with the race handling on it. But I do feel the race handling is, it's really touchy, but I feel like it's a lot better once you get used to it. So I do suggest that on all the planes. Not a bad looking plane, really. I mean, it's something different. It's not that expensive. I mean, if you add all the weapon upgrades and stuff like that, it's, it gets to be probably one and a half million. But 850000 to purchase it and just do the basic upgrades and have about a million in it. It's not too bad. I know a lot of people aren't a huge fan of this, but something a little different in the game. Here's probably your most important feature of it. It lands on water. So it'd be useful in some missions. Not really a whole lot. Maybe someday if we get like the naval DLC everybody's talking about, it'd be a little bit more useful. And we'll check out the new weapons. See if it lights up the stuff or whatever. Oh. There we go. I'm going to attempt to land this by my office because the, another thing I wanted to check out is if they added any bonuses on the CEO crates because I got them about to sell. What's up, Justin Sandlin? A little late. That's all right. Better late than never. I was just covering. I just bought this thing, customized it. Good morning. Like I said it's not, it's not the best plane. I get it. What's up, Delta? Yeah, I'll probably suggest most people just save your money on it. It's probably not the best plane to be just wasting money on, but if you have plenty of money and you want something a little weird and different, why not? And I'm going to crash it. Warstock? No, it's on Elitis. We'll bring it up right now. Like I said, I don't know offhand. It's probably around $1.2 for the buy it now, but if you have the discounts, it's 850000 And of course, it's not a. It's a new one of the new planes, so it has. You have to have the hangar to buy it. Obviously, you can't. It's not a Pegasus vehicle. We'll just drive it down the road. But it does have the uh, bombs you can drop, so it does have those weapons that are decent if you know how to use them. You can't add any like really effective weapons other than that. It has the machine guns, and that's pretty much it. And let's, let me get my office so nobody gets crazy with. Their hydras or nothing. Uh, why is it not letting me in here? Oh, it did let me in there. Okay, there we go. 
<clears throat> Alright, we'll enter the office and then I'll cover the new bonuses and what they took away, which I thought was really weird. I figured they'd just keep all the old bonuses and add new ones, but they did take away the Transform races. It's only the new Transform races double money in RP right now. So I'll go through those one more time since we got some people actually showing up now so you don't have to like rewind the, screen or the stream or nothing. Sorry guys, I'm exhausted. I'm trying to get through this. <laughs> Adversary modes. There you go, your beast versus slasher. The one in the bunker for the slasher. Double money RP, come out to play, double money RP. Condemned, it's still double money RP. All of those are. And scroll on down. There's several of them though, they did add several. We might get a playlist of some of these built up. And get some people in there doing those. Lost in the Dam, I love this one. I could make a playlist of just these and do them. There's seven of them. That's the one with the angels versus the devils. If you, I always called it angels versus demons, but it's actually called Lost in the Dam. It's double money in RP now. Uh, for some reason, they added the the one. Oh, wait, wait a minute, we got Slasher first. Yeah, Slasher, of course, it's double money in RP. And they added the stockpile back with the planes for some reason. Those are really good ones, though, so I would definitely be down for doing some of those later, too. And I think there's some more down here somewhere. Maybe. Maybe not. No, that was the last one. So that's all your double money in RP. And on your stunt races, they removed the transform races. As you can see, they're not showing double money anymore, except for the Inferno, which is the new one. It's still got the double money in RP. And while I'm in my office, I did want to check. My biggest concern was if they added any kind of bonuses to the CEO crates because I've been holding on to these, hoping they would do a bonus either this week or I don't think I'll hold on to them next week. But I waited Friday and I wanted to wait till today to make sure. It would be awesome if they did, though. We got... It is no. There's no bon there's no bonus on it. That's what they were worth two million already. All right, so no bonus on that. Uh, somebody was saying the warehouses, not these are warehouses. Somebody said the vehicle warehouses may have been on sale. We'll check those. I just want to confirm whether they are or not. I don't think they are. Oh wait, yeah they are. They're thirty percent off too. All right, that started back on Friday. I did not know that. On, none of my, on any of my streams, I just said it was the stuff on uh, the foreclosure website. So, yeah, you have your vehicle warehouses are 30% off. You guys definitely need to take advantage of these businesses that are on sale. So, you got, uh, if you already have the office, just go in and buy the vehicle warehouse. They're 30% off. And everything on the Maze Bank foreclosures. So, that's any of your biker clubhouses. Your hangers, your bunkers, all of those are 30% off still. So you definitely want to take advantage of those. And you're getting double money on your crates for your hanger. Double money in RP there too. So we got some cool stuff going on. I said they, the biggest thing for today, of course, they dropped the new vehicle. I, it's, it's not the greatest, but you guys can look at it this way. They got the worst of the rest of them out of the way. You'll be popping in and out. JHL, I'm not going to be on very long. I just wanted to showcase some of this new stuff and then uh, hop out. That's pretty much all I was going to do. Uh, like I said, I'm exhausted. I stayed up all night for it. We might stream for a little bit longer, though. Uh, I might get back down and check out the sea breeze. Hopefully nobody in here kills us. I do want to fly out and check... The Oh, that's lovely. God, you keep scaring me. Every time I come out of a business, you're standing there. <laughs> you can hop in. You should be able to. I think it's a two-seater. Yeah. Hop in my lovely sea breeze. Just to know... Just so I know for sure, I'm going to check out my... Oh, God. Let's not blow this up. I'm going to check out my hangar and my... Oh, it's smoking. That's gross. <laughs> Anyway, here's the new vehicle. Great double my No, JD2, they are not. I just checked them. The, those are not. You want the no the Nakoda? It is the last vehicle I want. Yeah. The Nakoda is the last one I'm really hyped for. And it will be between that and the Cyclone coming out next. 
Cyclone is okay. I'll take it. So I feel like the best two we're getting next, most likely. I'm going to check the bunker stuff. I'm going to make sure it's not double money. Then I'll fly over and check out import-export. Just to be sure. Because <laughs> you never know. Because they did change up all the adversary modes that are double money, so they could very well add something else. We're going to probably die. Oh my god. Yo. Bail out, bail out, bail out. Escape. <laughs> Run away, run away. <laughs> Nope, no crates. And that sucks to have all mine. I got like five million dollars worth of crates ready to sell. I will be selling those later today. I'm gonna do a screen selling those, and uh, probably play some more, some of these adversary modes and stuff that are double money. And then I'm supposed to be doing a talk it out with Tylerius, so hopefully we work that out and we get that done tomorrow sometime. And then late later tomorrow evening, I've got the final episode for the uh, Until Dawn. It's gonna be coming out. Okay, the value's the same, so it's not double money either. We have one last thing to check, and I'm sure it's not, but we're going to check the vehicle cargo. And uh, I don't know about the biker. I have no, I had no product built up. So if anybody knows, shout it out and let me know. Secure serve. I don't know if, uh, lovely lime, you don't have any biker stuff ready to go, do you? Uh, no. Oh. Alright. Don't know if you're going to get the Cyclone. Yeah, I don't, uh... I don't feel like it's going to be competitive in races. We'll have to wait to see to know for sure. Oh, let me get you hired in here. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, we'll get you hired so you can get in there. But yeah, I don't think it's going to be very competitive in races. I think you're just going to be buying it for the looks and because it's an electric car and it's something different. We may, I may be wrong. It may be the fastest car in the game or best handling. I don't know. We'll have to test it out whenever we actually, when it actually drops. I feel like it's probably coming next because I think they're going to be doing the either. Yeah, it almost has to be next. They may do the Nakoda and then it, but I feel like they're going to save the Nakoda, the Hunter, and the Laser to last because that's what most people are wanting. You have a minute, create large, and I already have one, so should I upgrade? Wait a minute. I have a medium crate warehouse, and I have the money for a large, and I already have one. So should I upgrade the medium and have two large? The way I have mine set up, JD2, and I love it now. I used to always run one large one and one small one, and I would go back and forth. Uh, I would do three crates in the large one and one in the small one, and I would just sell the small one as it filled up, and then wait for my large one for a big sale. Recently, I switched it. I kept the small one. I have two large ones, and I love it. It's much better that way. I got, I do three crates at a time, back and forth between the two large ones, and then whenever I get a rare item, I put it in the small warehouse. I love that setup. Of course, if you don't want to downgrade, your medium one will work the same way. Just have two larges in the medium. I feel like it goes a lot faster, and I'm, I feel like I make more money that way because it really, it if you're doing three crates at a time, Depending on how many of them are the, like, the crates that are all in one van, you can almost fill up two large warehouses in the same time as one because of the cooldown time. It may take you a little bit longer. So you're looking at filling up a large warehouse with the cooldown timer is like eight hours anyway. So if you're doing that back and forth with another one, you're only losing a little bit of time. So you're talking maybe ten hours to fill up two large warehouses. Yeah, some people, Justin, some people aren't into the crates. Really, your best money solo is to combine the import-export and the bunker. Feels good selling a large warehouse. Yeah. Uh, I'll be doing that later. I'm going to sell two of... i got two large warehouses ready to go, and my small one has like two or three rare items in it. So i got like $5 million worth to sell later today. And I would most likely do those solo. Like 95% of my crate sales have been solo. Okay, filter by range. I don't think I have any top range. I don't. Well, we're not selling anyway. We're just going to look at the medium range just to see. No, there's no bonuses on them. Because that's the normal price on those. Alright. So yeah, that just looks like the Sea Breeze. And they changed up the adversary mode bonuses and did away with the race bonuses except for the new one.
that kind of looks like everything that's been going on. You, I moved bunkers and I haven't set it back up again. The bunker is just too good of money, really. I mean, yeah, you have to pay for the upgrades to get your most money. But even without it, just buy your supplies and let it fill and go about your day. And come back and you have money just sitting there waiting for you. And if you combine that with being able to do your import export, it's just, I mean, it's just, you make, you make all kinds of money. I had, actually have a video on that. <laughs> Trying to think, uh, what's up? See if any vehicles are on sale. Oh yeah, I didn't check all of those. I believe they're the same ones, but we will check just to make sure. Good plan. I like the way you think, Tyler. All right, let me bring up the phone. Warstock, uh, yeah, it looks like the same ones. Mall talk still on sale. Half track, weaponized Tampa still are. Ramp buggy, Phantom wedge, Blazer Aqua. Did they add that one? And the Runner 2000. Oh, they did add some. And the Insurgent, it's on sale now. They did add some. Okay, yeah, good looking out there, Tyler. So they added the Blazer Aqua and the Insurgent to the sales on here. I'm assuming they're all 30% off. The old ones were 30% off. Let's see. My math skills aren't that great, but I believe that's about right. On my original stream on Friday, I said they were 25, but then I checked the newswire and they said 30. So yeah, I believe they're all 30% off. So it's just under a million for the Blazer Aqua now. And the Insurgent, they added that to the sale price, if you don't already have an Insurgent. Alright, let's check out uh, Legendary, see what they got going on. They got the Cheetah Classic, so they added that, because the Infernus was, it was the Infernus and the rest of them already were. So they added the Cheetah Classic. The GP1's on sale now, they added it, the Penetrator and the Shitaro still are. And that may be it for this site. So yeah, they have added a few vehicles on sale. And Southern San Andreas, we had the Retinue already was. All these were. The Rat Rod, the Sanctus, and the Vortex already were. Uh, Frankenstein and Lurcher, they still were from Friday. And we'll see if anything else was. Doesn't look like it. No. And of course, the well, we can check the Benny's site. See if Benny's got anything on sale. Cause he does a couple rare vehicles on it. Don't look like it. Now, if the Benny upgrades are on sale, well, I won't really know. I don't. Oh, I do have one. Actually, I do have one I could test it on to see. I have a. LG Retro in my Fast and Furious garage, or regular LG in the Fast and Furious garage. I can check it to see if it's got a discount on the upgrade. In case y'all want Benny upgrades on a discount, we can check it out. I'm trying to think of anything else. The only other thing I haven't checked as far as businesses go is the biker stuff because I don't have any product built up. So if anybody on there, if anybody's on, and you have your biker stuff with some product, just let me know if it looks like it's got a bonus on it. And, of course, the bunker and biker stuff, a lot of times here lately they've been doing where they fill up 25% faster. I won't be able to know that until the newswire, newswire comes out, so that'll just all be up in there until then. I will be streaming later, like I said, to sell this CEO crates, so I will cover the newswire then, so we'll know absolutely everything. No on the MC, Nuno? All right. Yeah, I didn't think they would add any other businesses because the hangar's already double money. And there's a jerk with a rocket, oh, of course. Yeah. This is what happens when you're in a public lobby. Thanks, buddy. He just saw two, e two easy kills right there and he went for it. Whatever. Yeah. Appreciate you, sir. Anyway. Oh, he's right outside my office, too. Yeah, I'm just gonna How do I? Oh, I got cops on him. Get out of here. I don't trust nobody. Go away. 
Great, I'm on cops on me. Thanks, people. Y'all run everything. <laughs> Don't kill me, officer. Oh my god, they killed me right as I can shoot. That's about right. <laughs> anyway, so it's a no on the MC. Okay, uh, again, let me get inside here. I forgot what I was doing now. They distracted me. Just let me get in here to say. Oh, I know what I was doing. I was going to my garage to see if the Benny's upgrades were discounted. See what happens when you get in public lobbies. You get like these mean people that just pick on you all the time. I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to be in the safety of my own little office. All right, here's a Fast and Furious garage for any of you that didn't go watch my video on it. Thanks, guys. God. Oh. <laughs> well, uh. Sorry. <laughs> Tell all your friends to come sub. I wanted to hit uh, 520 subs last night. We were so close. Ended up at like 519. So if anybody in there is new, please go ahead and sub. Love me. I need attention. I have a problem. <laughs> just kidding. I'm just being stupid. We'll blame it on the sleep deprivation. Alright. We're going to model. I'm not going to upgrade this vehicle because it goes with my Fast and Furious garage. I'll check and see if it's a discount on the upgrade. You think you've seen all my videos? Probably have. Upgrade? No, it is not on discount. It's still 900,000. Okay. That's all I need to know. So we got that covered. Nuno's the man. He wouldn't make up stories, so uh, he's selling coke while he's waiting. So, okay, there's no, there's no bonus on anything as far as businesses go. What else can we check? Um... Oh! One of the main things that are awesome double money would be heist. Let's see if they're double money. No, it's not popping up on my menu. I don't know if it does on my own heist or not, though. We'll just go check it out. Whatever. What else we got to do? We already bought the plane. We checked out the other stuff. I'm not really going to start this heist, but I'm going to go into the load screen just to see. How sweet would double money be on that? Regular ve vehicle upgrades. Yeah, we can check that out. Uh, heist? No, heist is not double money. I didn't think so. Uh, the big money stuff, it'd be pretty rare for them to do double money on more than one of them. Alright, we'll enter the garage. <coughs> heist. <laughs> Dream with it. I'm dreaming, man. I'm dreaming. Uh, there were already were some regular vehicle upgrades. Actually, I think there was on the plane. I didn't even check. Oh, somebody was just asking me to build this car, too. This is my... Suicide Squad, uh, Joker car. Somebody just add, <laughs> asked for that one as one of my movie car builds. So we'll use it to go test. I should probably not pull out of this garage. Oh, that's cool. Okay, look now. All right, they're impassive. What's up? What's up, Kiwiibi? All right, is anybody over there? We're gonna get shot up. I should have just stayed in my office where it was safe. It's pretty much clear the whole way to be fair. Yeah, except for this psycho that we were killing earlier. He's gonna blow us up for sure. Or oh, he's on the other side, he can't see us. <laughs> oh, there's a guy. Don't shoot me. Oh god. Dang pedestrian runs everything. Bad as these regular guys. It made me so mad. Uh oh, there's somebody over there. Gross. Watch. No way he's nice enough to let us pull in here. Oh, he's AFK. Okay, good. <laughs> that was the only way. And this is closed? No, okay, I'm about to say that better not be closed. Alright, we'll check the regular vehicle upgrades. Uh, armor is not. Brakes are not. Nope. Explosives, I don't know why you would want them. Oh, you do have the Halloween stuff back. It is on discount because it's Halloween related. And any of the vehicles you can put the stuff on the dash, the Halloween ones should be on discount too. Anything to deal with Halloween should be on discount. Um, lights, no. No, no on discount. Respray, no discount there. No, don't look like we're getting any discounts on car upgrades at all.
No. Double money, I believe. At what? Good double money, I believe. After Halloween, there's good double money right now. Don't get me wrong. Like I'm being kind of negative on stuff that's not going on now. But if we covered a lot of stuff that's double money, it's actually a really good double money week because you still have the hangar cell missions that are double money RP. They took away the transform races except for the new one, but they added a bunch of adversary modes. All the Halloween related adversary modes and they added the uh, stockpiling back. They're all double money, double RP. So there's a lot of double money opportunity right now. So surely you can find an adversary mode that you're decent at and take advantage of that. If you don't already have a hanger, then you can use that money to purchase a hanger. Hammer that stuff out. If you watch my stream technically yesterday now, I just did uh, a full sell on the chemicals and I made two and a half million off of that. And then yesterday I did one with just 25 crates and I made 855,000 off that. So there's good money in the hangar, especially now. All right, we'll all enter up in here. Anybody else think of something I may be forgetting? Let's see. There's just so much going on in this game. It's hard to remember everything. But like I said, if I do miss anything, it'll be on the newswire, and I will cover it in the stream later today. But yeah, for the people, again, just tuning in, go down. Here's the new vehicle. It even has the picture of it on the website thing. Elitist Travel. There it is, Sea Breeze. It's okay. It has some decent little liveries on it. It lands on water. It drops bombs on it. The guns on it are pretty much garbage they're useless but it does hit, drop bombs on it so you can do that but the biggest thing is it lands on water and it holds two people so it's something special about it 850,000 it's on the cheaper side it's one almost one of the what the ultralight was the only one cheaper out of the all the stuff added the smugglers run so it's pretty fairly priced if you want just something weird and different to travel around in if you're tight on money I'd don't suggest buying. It's not really going to be useful for anything to make money. Uh, now on the war stock, you do have some pretty decent sales over here. Uh, the Maltox, a lot of people really like this one. It's 30% off. I own it. It's not a bad plane. Again, it's one of them. It needs explosive rounds. I don't know why it doesn't have them. Uh, the half track, we've had a lot of fun with the half track before in sessions. It's just really slow, but the weapons are really good. What's up? A2K 800. I am on uh, the PS uh, PS4. Weaponized Tampa. This would probably be almost the best vehicle in the game if this thing would just take one stinking rocket. But it's still pretty decent and it's 30% off. Ramp Buggy and Phantom Wedge. They're 30% off. They're not really that great because you run into a certain number of, number of vehicles and they explode. But if you swap them out and take them back to your vehicle storage or whatever... You can get it resets it, but still, it's they're fun to play with, but they're really not that useful. Blazer Aqua, I love this thing just because it's something different. You can go in and out of water, and it's the fastest one that does both. The guns on it suck, but it's under a million now. It's thirty percent off. Runner two thousand, it's thirty percent off, so it's down to three million. If you were interested in this car, it'll probably never be cheaper than this. So pick it up if you've been wanting to get this car for a while now. And the Insurgent. It's not a bad vehicle to own either. So uh, that's another one that's 30% off now. And that's it for this website. Like I said, they added new cars to all of them. Legendaries. They added the uh, Cheetah Classic. And of course, these are the ones that were already on sale since Friday. So you got the Cheetah Classic, the Infernus Classic, the Rustin, which it's just weird looking, but it's it's on sale. Penetrator, not one of the better supercars, so I wouldn't suggest it either. The GP1, it's a, got a lot of customization. I think it's a really cool looking car. It's not very much, not very good on the performance though. Again, the Shitaro, if you don't have one of these, pick it up. It's like the best bike in the game. I love this thing. I've won so many bike races with this thing. Of course, you do have bikes that are way cheaper, like millions cheaper, <laughs> because they're like twenty thousand or whatever that can almost keep up with it but this thing's just amazing i love the bike and that's my favorite adversary mode anyway uh, i think that's it for this website yeah we'll scroll down but yeah that's it for this web this website we'll go over to the southern san andreas 
and we got uh, the retinue still on sale, rat rod still on sale, sanctus still on sale in the vortex. Now a couple of these, the Halloween ones, we're assuming the Batmobile is going to be limited time because it came out on the Halloween update on Friday. So, uh, oh, how to PS4 screen? Oh, well, stream on the PS4? It has a built-in thing. You can just go press your uh, your share button and go down to broadcast, and you can do that. Do it that way. You don't need uh, Elgato or any kind of outside program like you do with PC or Xbox. Anyway, back to what I was saying. The Sanctus is going to be a limited time one, so if you don't purchase it when the event's over, you're not going to be able to get it. And same with these two down here, the uh, Albany Lurcher and the Albany Frankenstein. They're Halloween specials. So these three will pretty much be gone until next Halloween after this is going on. They're 30% off right now. And we're assuming the Batmobile will be too. But yeah, the Vortex, that's not a bad bike. That's a pretty good deal on a bike. It's under 250000 you can get like an alien face on it. It's got some cool liveries on it. And it's one of the fast. It's not like the fastest bike, but it's one of the faster ones. It's not bad. And I think that's it for this website. We already covered those two. So yeah, we got a bunch of good sales. And we'll check out. Oh my God, I pop back in here and Jason Voorhees staring at me. Uh, we'll do. Uh, cover these one more time. On the jobs. Play jobs. Uh, Rockstar created the stunt races. I'll show you transform races. I don't know why they didn't leave these double money, but they did away with that except for the Inferno, which is the new one. So the Inferno one's still double money. The rest of these transform races are not. I don't think any of the stunt races are either. I think I flipped through all these too. Yeah. So yeah, it's just that one race is the only one that's double money in RP. Then you go down to your adversary modes. They added a bunch on here because it was just the new one the condemned uh so we got beast versus slasher what country am i from i am from antarctica inferno is weird i know it is weird i do like that race though it's kind of fun and justin if you're showing up uh wednesday for my giveaway i don't know who all is going to be doing that but uh check out the video i got the details on it that is the race i used in that playlist so you can get some practice in but we got uh, beast versus slasher double money in rp the bunker version of Slasher is double money RP. The come out to play is double money in RP. Condemned, that's the new one. It's still double money in RP. It just came out Friday for Halloween. Um, scroll on down. This is where we get the, like, the long scroll through. I've done this like three times now on this stream already. But this is what we're here for. Uh, Lost in the Damned. This is probably my favorite out of the bunch. It's, I always call it Angels vs. Demons, but it's Lost vs. Damned. That one's double money, double RP. And the Slasher will be too. Which a lot of people were excited about that. So you got Slasher. They're all double money in RP. You have a Twitter in it. Oh, yeah. I'm glad you mentioned that. Yeah, anybody that's new out there, please subscribe if you're new. Uh, hit that like on your way out. And you can follow me on Twitter at Benningfield01. I always post whenever I go live or whenever a new video drops and you can keep in contact with me. And if you checked out some of my uh, other... Okay, Gabe, I just did that, but we'll get back to it. I'll show them, I'll show them all again. Uh, Slasher's Double Money in RP. And the stockpile is... And the War Stock. It's the same sales as Friday, except they added a couple vehicles. So will pop up, go down there, Warstock, they already had, the mall talk was already 30% off, so was the half track and the Tampa, the Doom Buggy and the Phantom Wedge, they're still 30% off, same as Friday, they added the, the Blazer Aqua, it's 30% off now, the Runer 2000 already was, and then they added the Insurgent, so since Friday the only new ones is the Insurgent and the Blazer Aqua. And for, uh, I don't think Elitus had any sales. I guess I should have checked there, too. But no, yeah, there's no sales on Elitus. Oh, there is. They added the Bursera, the Bessera. I was thinking about buying that plane. I might actually buy that now. I was wanting to buy it the other day on my spending spree. In fact, I'm going to purchase that. This is one of the few vehicles I don't own in the game. Send me your social network links. The only one I got is Twitter. You can follow me on there. It's Benningfield01. So 
So there you go. The best there is on sale for 30% off. I did just pick me up one. You watched it here. <laughs> I actually really like that plane. I never owned it. All right. Um, what else? Oh, the Maze Bank stuff. All of that is still 30% off. Anything in here. So all of your bunkers, hangers, and uh, your uh, clubhouses, they're all 30% off. You still have the double money and RP on your hangar sales. And also vehicle warehouses are 30% off. Check the boats. Oh, yeah. Check the boats. Doc tees. Oh, good call. We got the Lampadati Toro. It looks like it's 25 or 30% off. Um, I don't know about these because I get them. I get that free because I'm a returning player. My social ID, it's a bidding field, same as the channel name, and then with zero one on it. The number zero and the number one. So yeah, they added the Toro is on sale on Doc Tees. I checked the Benny's vehicles. But there's no discount on upgrades or anything in Benny's. Uh, I guess we checked the. Maybe they added offices. We could check that. I didn't even think about looking at that. No, they're still full price. Maybe the garages or something are on discount. We can check. Renovate. No, renovation is still the same. That's not good. Yeah, I don't want to do that. And we can check the regular uh, apartments and stuff. If anybody that might want one of those, I don't think they are. But we can run through them. It's Halloween. They should have like the creepy little houses on sale. That would be so funny. <laughs> like the little rundown shack house. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything on sale. Mm, nope. Uh, oh, biker businesses. I guess I, I'd have to run down and check out. There you go. D Bailey hooked it up. Biddingfield01. That's the Twitter. Let's head down. This is going to be bad. We'll leave on we'll exit vehicle. We'll, go in the, we'll just take the buzzer and hope we don't get shot down. Select the pilot. I'm the pilot. Hopefully we can make it over here. Uh, we'll check out the mask too. I would. They didn't have the Halloween mask on discount, I don't think, Friday. Or I just wasn't paying attention. But we'll check out that. Oh my god, there's people over here. They're going to shoot us down for real. Oh no, they're in the Batmobile. They're in the Batmobile. They're really going to shoot us down. It's not like shit. Hurry up and land. Luckily, my biker thing's right over here. We'll see if they did the biker businesses on sale. They do have the clubhouses are 30% off. So we'll check and see if the you can purchase businesses that are at discount. And the bicycles. <laughs> LOL. Hey, I like my bicycles. Don't be don't be laughing about those. How you have so much money? Check out the channel, Gabe. You must be new. I'm always grinding. I make I uh, just sold my hanger and stuff on the stream I'd say earlier today, but really it was yesterday, last night. Uh, I sold it for two and a half million. I made uh already made like ten million off of my hanger. A little over actually, probably closer to fifteen million by the time you figure in the bonuses that don't show up. I've got over 50 million in crates. I've done a ton of heist. My biker businesses, they're not showing it now, but if you go on my older streams, I had like 60 million worth of biker business sales, but I just moved them all back to the city, so it reset those counts. I got like 50 million in my import export sales, so a lot of money grinding on here. But yeah, majority of it came from, uh, oh, I gotta quit this, hold on. I forgot I'm in a, I'm in the CEO. I gotta quit and join the biker. There we go. Uh, we'll check this out. Like I said, these weren't on sale Friday, but maybe they added. They have changed up quite a bit of stuff. Um, buy business. Four, three. No, no, they're all. None of these are on sale either. That's okay. We got some good bonuses. But yeah, man, anybody that's new, please subscribe. I'm I'm on my road to a thousand. We crushed it early. By the end of this month, I was wanting to hit five hundred. We crushed that like four or five days early. Um uh, so yeah, if we can crush the goal is I'd like to hit a thousand by the end of the year. So hopefully we can get that done. Cannot see your Twitter profile. 
I don't know why you can't. It's open. My DMs are open. It's got my picture on it. That is me. If you do find it, that is me. That's my ugly mug in the corner. <laughs> uh, what else was it? Oh, I think I'm going to just go on passive so these guys don't mess with us. I'm going to go check out the mask. We'll check out some clothing and stuff like that real quick. Just in case they added something on sale. Uh, let's see, let me go in passive. All right. Oh, I can't use that chopper no more. Or can I? Oh, I can still use it. Perfect. All right, we'll fly on over to the... Oh, can you still get in this? Oh, good, you can. All right. Yeah. This guy's probably going to blow it up as soon as I land it. We're going to... At least he won't kill me and we can check out the mask. You bought all the Halloween items? Yeah, I did too. Uh, for those of you that don't know, you have to purchase them to keep them. They will go away at the end of the week. That includes all of the masks, the uh, the vehicles that came out, the face paints. And I know when you go in there and you purchase the face paint and you scroll down and purchase the next one, it says you have to purchase the last one again. That's just because it charges you every time you change them. But if you per each one that you purchase at least once, you keep forever. You can always pay to change it back to that. Uh, monsters. I think they're in monsters, aren't they? I would think. Heist, heist. Yeah, okay, they're all they're all on sale too. I already have them all purchased, so I don't know how much. I uh, would assume 25 or 30 percent. I think everything's been like 35 percent off for whatever reason. You got to go, D Bailey. Appreciate you coming out, Justin. You still have to do the face paints. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I went through and bought all of them already. And those, actually, those are on discount because I remember checking. So all the Halloween masks are. I would assume that happened on Friday, actually. What's up? Drop like button. There you go, Kevin. Appreciate it. Good looking out. No, you guys sub if you're new. Did they really blow my chopper up? They did, didn't they? They just straight stole it. Oh, they stole it? What a jerk. <laughs> <laughs> he stole my chopper. What a jerk. All right, we'll just steal this car. Whatever. But yeah, man, um, there's no Halloween tattoos or anything like that, which would be cool if there was. Uh, but yeah, actually, I'm, I do remember the face paints are on sale, or they were Friday. I don't know why they would cancel that on Halloween. But uh, we'll go check that out. Uh, oh, here's the haircut place. Happy Halloween. That's right, Kevin. My favorite holiday. I love it. Any of you guys that are new to the channel, um, I've got a lot going on for uh, Halloween. I'm going to be doing my GTA big sales or whatever coming up, but we're going to do, uh, I've been doing a no Until Dawn series. I started on Friday the 13th, and I got uh, one more episode worth to go, and we're going to finish it up tonight for Halloween. Uh, yeah, the Halloween face paint. I got all of these, I think, or at least all the better ones. I don't think I got some of these down at the bottom because I don't really like them. Like these, I don't think I got any of these. I think I got everything else. So yeah, these are 30% off as well. Looks like 25-30% off. I don't really know what the original price was. But I'm pretty sure everything's 30% off for some reason this time. Uh, Alright, I think that covers about everything. Uh, like I said, I will be doing my big... So oh, you found it? Yep, that's it. Jason Benningfield at Benningfield01. That is it. <clears throat> Appreciate you checking out. Yeah, follow me on there. Uh, any of you guys, I also have uh, the Halloween special I'm doing in honor of Halloween and hitting my 500 sub goal early. I'm doing a $20 PSN giveaway. I have a video explaining all the details on it, but it will be uh, tomorrow now. It will be uh, Wednesday, November 1st at 5 p.m. Central Time. I have a playlist set up of sort of Halloween themed stuff. There's five things in the playlist. Winner of the playlist gets the PSN code. And it's uh, because of the missions I chose, there's only up to 16 people, so it's going to be one of them going to be me, obviously. So 15 people, first come, first serve, get in. Whoever wins the playlist gets the PSN code. If for some odd reason, which I really doubt it, but if I do happen to win it, it'll just get rolled over to another event. 
but yeah check out that video for all the exact details and all that stuff if you want I actually show the playlist and what modes are on it and if you wanted to get in and get some practice in today <clears throat> and good luck to you, whoever one of y'all show up it's way too early bud you ain't even off work yet I know Alan luckily I'm off today but yeah we're calling it pretty early I've been at it for like an hour on here I just wanted to show off all the new stuff yeah Kevin I'll see you later but if any of you guys, 16 people out there watching, uh, or anybody that has, happens to be watching this after the fact, any of you guys are new, please sub to the channel. It is much appreciated. I do appreciate each and every one of you. I say that on stream and on videos, man. It's all the all the GTA YouTubers alone, not to mention all the other stuff you could be watching. If you take time out of your day to spend some time with me, check check out my content, and I really appreciate it, man. It's it it never stops boggling my mind i do appreciate all the love people are showing me and we're building this channel quicker than i ever expected so it is much appreciated so yeah if you're new please sub if you enjoyed the video press that like button and again it was popped up in the chat just a second ago follow me on twitter benningfield01 i always post out whenever i go live or new video drops hate to cut this one short I usually do longer streams but we just want to check out the new stuff the new plane that came out the new discounts and uh, check out the bonuses and stuff and wanted to get all that stuff covered I will be streaming later today so uh, please come back and I'll catch you guys in the next video peace